Our squad is unique because we are a true spirit squad. I am the only coach and I coach two separate programs that we have integrated into one. So most schools have a cheer program and then they have a dance program where we have created a cohesive program amongst cheer and dance. So the spirit squad is comprised of the Boise State cheerleaders as well as the mainline dancers. If they have blue pom-poms, they're a cheerleader. If they have orange pom-poms, they're a dancer and they go cheerleader, dancer, cheerleader, dancer on the sidelines. We impact the game day atmosphere because we are constantly bringing energy and hype or blue chaos to the football field, to the basketball arena. I used to joke and say like we don't affect the outcome of the game, but I, I truly believe that we do because we are the ones that are out there like energizing the crowd, getting that 12th man, right, getting that 6th man excited. And we see that impact at football games when Albertson Stadium gets so loud and we cause turnover, we cause them to fumble. For me, it is just creating that insane environment. What makes us different from other teams is we are cheering on the Broncos, but then we also have the opportunity to compete at nationals. Both our cheer team and dance team are able to travel to those competitions and compete against top teams in the nation. I think the most challenging part about being on the team is the crazy schedule we have. We are constantly supporting Boise State Athletics and going out into the community and doing events and constantly putting in hours of preparation that a lot of people don't see. I mean, we're up at 6 a.m. running laps and running full outs and going through routines and throwing tricks and back tucks and aerials early in the morning. The majority of the kids on my team, you know, they're a full-time student, they're a member of the Spirit Squad, majority of them hold jobs, and so they're balancing a huge workload and they're really focusing on grades. We had a team GPA this semester of a 3.51, which was pretty incredible, considering that they're managing so much. It could be 20 to 30 hours a week, just between practices and games. Our season runs April through April. Tryouts are in April, and then we're working throughout the spring and summer, and then we come back and we're preparing for football in the fall, and then as soon as we know, it's volleyball and basketball season. When we go to competition, we practice all year round to go out there for one two minute routine. Putting the emphasis on getting mentally ready for me is like just as important if not more important than the physicality aspect of it. Something that I did different this year is I am partnering with a mindset coach. With that we focus a lot on our positive self-talk. What are we talking about when we're getting ready to throw those big skills and step out on that national stage? How are we interacting with our teammates? What type of encouragement and feedback are we providing them to become mentally strong? Unless you actually walk into to our practices and see what we're doing on a day-to-day -day basis. You only see what we're putting out on the sideline, but they're not there to see the blood, sweat, and tears that we really go through. My biggest sentiment about this team is that they're the team behind all the other teams all the time, right? Like everybody sees them supporting everybody else. And I think we're getting to the point where people recognize them for the athletes that they are and the hard work that they put in specifically for themselves. Breaking the stigma of what it means to just be out there with pom-poms and a skirt. Like they are athletes every single day. They work incredibly hard, not only for themselves, but what they do for the university and the community as well. Oh my God, you're gonna make me cry. <gasps> I would just say that the Boise State Spirit Squad is such a special program and people truly don't know that unless you're a part of it. I feel like I've just gotten so much stronger as a person and as a dancer and I've learned what it takes to be dedicated to something. I'm just so proud of them. I'm so proud to be a Boise State Bronco and being able to be here and make that impact is better than anything I could ever ask for.